Bill, are you there? Hello. How might humans become post-human? It's technology-based, and it's assumed to be the result of the advent of functional nanotechnology or of some sort of uh, synergism in in these various emerging, you know, all these different emerging technologies we have. So if somehow there could be a synergism between computation and genetic research. What might that mean? Well, immortality, the end of economics, the functional nanotech would pretty much guarantee both of those because there would be, you know, no reason to die <laughs> if you had sufficient nanotech to keep resetting the little cellular clocks. And with even, even sort of half-assed nanotech, you can make anything out of anything. So you can make gold bars out of McDonald's burgers or McDonald's burgers out of garbage. And it'd be, there's no basis for this whole thing that we've always done about value. Anyone could have anything, anything they wanted at, at any time. And it would if you had sufficient nanotech to keep resetting little cellular clocks. And with even, even sort of half-assed nanotech, you can make anything out of anything. So you can make gold bars out of McDonald's burgers or McDonald's burgers out of garbage. But be, there's no basis for this whole thing that we've always done about value. Anyone could have anything, anything they wanted at, at any time. And it would everything, including human beings, would be completely protein.